Tennessee has a lot of weird and fun history. So today, I want to share 10 fun things about Tennessee and we're going to get started. Hello and welcome back to All Things Tennessee with me, Ben Barreto, your local real estate pro and relocation expert for East Tennessee. If you're thinking of East Tennessee and need a realtor or you just maybe have some questions about the area before a visit, I got you covered. No need to reach out to anyone else. Don't hesitate to call me. My contact information is in the description. It's also right down here. And listen, while you're here, make sure to hit that like button and hit that subscribe button. It really helps me out. It helps out my business, helps out my family. I appreciate it. Now with all that out of the way, let's jump into the video of today. So Tennessee officially became a state on June 1st of 1796. And in that time, we've racked up a lot of rich and interesting history. What I wanna to do today is share that with you in these 10 fun facts about the state of Tennessee. So let's jump in with it. So first off, if you didn't know, Tennessee is tied for the state with the most borders. The two states with the most state borders are Tennessee and Missouri, which in fact is one of the eight states Tennessee touches. The other seven states are Kentucky, Virginia, North Carolina, Arkansas, Georgia, Mississippi, and Alabama. There is actually a lake in the state of Tennessee that was created by an earthquake. Real Foot Lake, located in Lake and Obion counties, was created by a series of violent earthquakes on the New Madrid Vault in 1811 and, or maybe early 1812, according to the state encyclopedia. Kingston was the state capital for one day. In 1807, Kingston was named the state capital for one day. And that's because the General Assembly met there in order to fulfill a treaty obligation they made with the Cherokee, in that, uh, according to the state encyclopedia. Today, Kingston is just Kingston. It's open, gorgeous farmland. It's picturesque. Check it out. Or Tennessee has 10 state songs. That's right, Tennessee has not one, not two, but 10 state songs. Here they are in order of adoption. Number five, uh, fun fact about Tennessee is Tennessee is the birthplace of the tow truck. Ernest Holmes of Chattanooga invented the vehicle in 1916. Six fun fact, aside from the White House, uh, Graceland is the most visited home in the country. In 2016, Elvis Presley's mansion celebrated its 20 millionth visitor. Now listen, of all southern states, Tennessee provided the most soldiers in the Union. That is awesome. We're the volunteer state. Actually, Tennessee provided more soldiers to the Union than all the Confederate states combined. Coca-Cola owes much of its success to Tennessee. According to the company's website, the beverage was created in Atlanta in 1886 and was sold as a fountain drink for years. But it wasn't until 1899 that two Chattanooga attorneys had the idea of starting a bottling company. They pitched the idea to the Coca-Cola president who gave the attorneys of the bottling rights for one dollar. The dollar never was collected, but the first bottling facility later opened in Chattanooga. Now we have a Pepsi bottling company here in, T in Knoxville, Tennessee. All right, before telling you 9 and 10, I wanted to point you to the last video I put on YouTube, and that's the best neighborhoods to live in, highlighting downtown Knoxville. I give you a little history, the pros and cons, and more. Check it out by clicking here, or you can follow a link in the description. All right, back to the fun facts. Number nine, mini golf was patented in the volunteer state. Although the game was not invented in this state of Tennessee, resident Garnett Carter got the first mini golf patent in 1927, for his Tom Thumb golf course. However, the course was constructed at his Fairyland Inn and in Lookout Mountain in Georgia, less than a mile from the Tennessee line, according to the Smithsonian Magazine. All right, number 10, the 10 fun fact is Tennessee has a few weird speed limits. According to Google Maps, a street in Collierville has a speed limit of 19 miles per hour, while Trenton has multiple signs that are 31 miles per hour. All right, well, that's it for today's video. I hope you found some of these facts fun and interesting. And as always, if I can help you with anything real estate related or Knoxville related, give me a call. Thanks for stopping by and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.